Somebody tell me about your trip, please. Were there any whales? Wait, let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. Do you have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Okay, here we go. Well, she'll see you at once. They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. They're... They're my citizens, and we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Corvo. Two days early. Full of surprises, as usual. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. What news have you brought? Follow me. I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before. Knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! Emily, get behind me! Corvo, thank you. If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! Corvo! Uh, 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 mommy! Uh, get away! Corvo! Corvo... It's all coming apart. Fine. Find Emily. Protect her. You're the only one. You'll know what to do. Won't you? Corvo. Ward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young lady Emily, traitor? Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Take him. Should eat, Corvo. This meal comes from a friend. Heard something. What, what the fuck? Here. That's okay.
pretty good prison. About average for my recent runs, though. I'm definitely getting better at it. Probably 641, maybe 640. 640. Not bad. Not bad at all. He won't get past me, sir. Samuel. That was good. And I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. Well, they said you'd come out here. I can still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. Just down the river from here. Pub closed for business. Half the district marked off as dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. Take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the loyalists. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can. So it's starting at night. We can continue this later. Yes. The arrows as much in ours. I'll be crafty. Can you get a new tank from upstairs? You should rest while you can. Sleep well. Good skip. gives me trouble sometimes.
how you you Otherwise a good outsider though. That was a really bad skip. I started it too early. Ready to go. Just give the signal. It'll be a rough trip. Used to be to go straight up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague. The other half's fighting over what's left. The City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall and light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gang territory. Then there are the real odd birds living on the fringes, like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. I don't know which is worse. Just take your pick. Uh, that was poor. Having trouble holding the side streets. A bunch of children playing games, that's all it is. I could probably do a blink better, actually. Wasn't bad. A few mistakes, but maybe it's not totally acceptable. Say, but men of the faith shouldn't live like barons. You ready to go? Okay, let's go. Pendleton are in the courtyard. I expect I want to congratulate you. Cool. You did it. Yes, yes, I did. Living on the north side of the river. The state depends on you. Oh goodness. Well that was terrible. Luckily, that was the only mistake I made. 
taken Lord Pendleton enough times, believe me. The rest of that went really smooth. Just that one blink down to the sewer was terrible. I'll get you as close as I can to the Golden Cat, Corvo. You'll have to go the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holger Square. The main thing is to make sure that little girl, Emily, gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on helping you get inside the cat, if he don't kill you. This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. They sell the elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. <sighs> I'll lay low, but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you bring him back. Good luck to you. I know Emily must mean a lot to you. Be careful. Okay. Ah. That's depressing. What the heck? Alright, so I'm having some major problems with execution, but I got good luck. And the slowdown. Oh, come on. Did not mean to hit that twice. This place is old. Alright, terrible execution on this mission. Come on. Come on. see what happens if I get another crack in the Are you both ready to go? Ugh. Corvo, you must have worked wonders out there in the city tonight. I can't believe my old eyes. I guess it's about average in terms of how bad I usually am with that mission, but those were some stupid mistakes. So you did the business, did you, Corvo? Really stupid mistakes. I don't want to speak against my betters, mind you, but if anybody ever deserved their fate, it was those Pendletons. What business are you talking about? Oh, Still a really good time so far, though. Grown up business, girl. Overall, I mean, that was the first mission yeah. where, where I made any okay. like series of I big heard mistakes. A lot of doing that business at the Golden Cat. Oh, I should concentrate on piloting this boat. My wrist hurts. When I started running Dishonored, like the very first day I did it, I was like half convinced that I'd never be able to do it because my pinky hurt from holding down shift so much. It just like, you never sprinted in this game, playing casually, and sprinting was like, hard for me, and my pinky like, seriously hurt after even half an hour of practicing the first mission, and now I don't even notice anymore. It's kind of funny. Good. I think I'll like it here. I'll go with Callista, Corvo. I'll see you later. You do not fail to improve. Armed with a blade, you've changed the course of the city forever. And with the Pendleton twins gone, our own Lord Pendleton will assume their votes in Parliament. In one night, you've done more than most men do in a life. I need to speak to you soon. But for now, Lord Pendleton requests your attention. Corvo. All right, my friend. 
Oh, that was stupid. Off to Caldwin's bridge, sir. We'll get our sleep later. Just climb aboard when you're ready. What do you think, Corvo? Caldwin's bridge. Been in the city for years, but you lived in Dunwall Tower with the late Empress, so maybe you haven't visited the bridge before tonight. Something to look out for. See all them lights on the water? That's right. We'll be spotted for sure. You're gonna have to shut off their power before I can pick you up. Now, about bringing Sokolov back alive, he's smart. Maybe even smarter than Piero. Got the whole of Dunwall under his thumb with all that natural philosophy business. New technology, potions and the like, seems dangerous to me. But, what do I know? I don't save about 13 seconds because I made a huge mistake in my PB. Alright. Once again, I have a really good run up till now. I've had so many good runs up till now, and they all failed for some reason. One by luck, one three by choking, and one by blue screen. But maybe, maybe this one will be different. It's like I can no longer get hype over a run anymore. Because I'm always on world record pace, and then something goes terribly wrong. It's like, I know I'm going to get world record, regardless of what happens at Boyle, well done, but what happens at Boyle will determine, like, how much I beat the world record by. If I complete a run, it will be the world record. You were making funny faces while you were sleeping. I decided to nap here in your room while Callista was taking her bath. She told me if there's ever trouble, I should always run here. Royal, you're part of this order. I hear you're your the boy old costume ball, huh? Well, that'll be fun, but not for everybody. You ready? All right, let's hope for good luck. In my PB, I got good luck, but not great luck. So there's time to save here. I might lose up to 15 or 20 seconds until I get really bad luck, though. And even that will still be on world record pace. Watch yourself, Corvo. They don't fool around. The good news is, once you get to the party, that mask of yours let you blend right in. Enjoy your evening out with the local quality. Better you than me.
Pendleton is a gutless, lying sack of murderous cheat. Hey! Nope. What's going on? Oh, please. Okay. Okay, that's not bad. That is not bad. That is totally acceptable. Enjoyed your evening, sir. But we'd best be on our way. Quickly. Alright, that was fine. Um, I'm on track to beat the world record by 19 seconds right now. Uh, I died in my PB on the very last mission, so I get a free 10 seconds at the end. And the world record is 7 seconds faster than my PB. So we're definitely on pace. I checked the wine cellar. And there are very few opportunities for the run to end due to luck after now. It still can, like if the assassins tether me at the beginning of Flooded District as I'm doing the sloth jump, or Dad decides to kill me or something like that, but those are all pretty unlikely. Did I think? You did it. And now we've done away with a woman and a uh. noble. I'm also doing YOLO strats in, uh, in Dunwall Tower. I've gotten them very consistent. I haven't messed them up in a run yet, so I'm pretty sure it's, it's going to be fine. But there's a chance that I just mess it up terribly in the run ends next mission. Attention Dunwall citizens. The streets Corbold. Remain off limits pending an ongoing investigation. That was terrible. Ready to face the Lord I lost a couple seconds. Time we took care of my say. I really messed up that blink. I should have double jumped. I usually double jump there. I don't know why I didn't. So I wasn't ready for uh, where I would have to aim the blink. Well, that's just two seconds, so whatever. This is it, Corvo. Last memories of Dunwall Tower might not be good ones, huh? So maybe you can make up for what happened back then. It'll be a bit of a climb from the water lot. This is probably the most difficult mission. Most mostly due to the strategies the I'm gonna use. Built himself quite a place at the top of the tower. Calls it his safe room or something. Crazy if you ask me. Another point of interest while I'm giving you the grand tour, Corvo. Broadcast control station here, where all them announcements come from. Might be worth looking into. You ready? Next time I see you, the Lord Regent will be dead. And if not, well, it was an honor to serve with you. You guys ready for yellow strats? Here we go. Success. One more yellow strat. I also have extra mana. What's going on there? Is it all done? Success. You ready to go back to the hound pits? Thanks to you, Corvo. Oh boy. Alright, let's go. Alright, now the big sweat. The next four or so minutes is complete in action, more or less. And after that is the most intense four minutes of the run. 
small fry like me always gets the worst. Like the longest stretch of actual difficult gameplay. The Lord Regent is gone. The Abbey has a new high overseer. I'm guessing our work is almost done. The others are in the bar. No doubt waiting to raise My previous three runs where I got this far me, I all ended because they choked. Here, you mind. So Which it's definitely not, not over. Congratulations. Ah, that was a bad blink. Didn't cost me too much though. I haven't missed that blink ever actually. It's like a really simple one. Alright. Samuel, you move like you've been... I'm gonna go get a drink and prepare myself. This is the one who was with the Empress when she died. Poison. Tibian stuff. Amateur work. Still live. That's up to doubt. shaking. What do you do with the drunken railing? What do you do with the drunken railing? What do you do with the drunken I should memorize that song. It's not bad. The one who talks to you in the dark. Talks to you when you visit his shrine. <sighs> I visited those shrines too. And I know what it felt like to shovel blade into your empress. But I don't know you. Who you are. And who you fight for. You're a mystery. And I can't allow that. My hands really are shaking. Keep. And that was a slow skip as well. I have a lot of time to waste. Like 17 seconds. But there are multiple things that can go wrong that will cost more than that. So I need to remember to quick save. Shoutouts to my sister. She's awesome. Uh, that brick decided not to cooperate, but it's not too bad. Quick save. Good. Alright, there's still at least two more places where the RNG can potentially end the run, but it's unlikely. One is at Dodd, one is where you pick up Emily's note. In both cases, the enemies that you're near are strong enough to kill you without you being able to do anything about it. And now we fight the duel that no two others can fight. This is between Corvo and me. Alright. That was decent.
I almost messed up that out-of-bounds glitch. I was barely inside the window. And I have exactly enough mana right now. Alright, that was a good flood of districts. Not my best ever, but within a few seconds of I do. Please, no. Awesome, those guys did not give me any trouble. Alright, one more mission. Thought I'd find you here. It never pays to bet against you, does it? That's good. That's one more trip across. Alright, I am see. set to beat the world record by 16 like seconds. Ought to be something to see. Last mission. This is it, sir. I suspect Havelock Martin and Lord Pendleton landed there a while ago and went into the lighthouse. Knowing them, they're not giving up without a fight. I remember hearing the Admiral and Martin talking about this place as where they'd hold up if they had to. Anybody going in has to breach the fort and the gatehouse, and there's only one way to the top. All I can say is that it's been a pleasure serving with you. And this time can be beaten by a minimum of 15 seconds as well. So this is not perfect by any means, but it's very good. Good luck, Corvo. If anyone deserves it, you do. I give my best to Emily. Slight mistake there. Almost messed that blink up actually, but it's working out. Alright, last area. Main areas that can be improved are Golden Cat and Boil, as usual. Everything else is pretty solid. Really? Lord Trip, did you think I'd fight you, Corvo? Sorry. Okay. 